Hello, <clears throat> welcome to Rims Models. I'm Rob, and this is my update number three of the Mini Art T55A with fault interior. <clears throat> Just before we start, I'd like to say a big thank you to all my subscribers and all your comments. It's really kind. I really appreciate it. Um, but I'll show you. I'll show you what I've done. I haven't done a lot since my last update because I've because I've been really busy at work. But I have managed to do a little bit. Let's show you, let's show you the main part. It's all glued together now. It's all fitted. And it, the fit the fit was really good. You've got that bit there, you're not gonna see that bit. You only see from the from the engine. There look. I've still got to do my wiring and that on there yet. As you can see, it's all fitted in, no problems at all. Yeah. As long as you keep all your <clears throat> all your mating surfaces clear, no paint on them, you'll have no problems. I've still got to weather the inside. I've still got a bit more to do yet, just to finish it off. That that piece is glued on. That there, the light. Um, Where's my pointy stick? The light there. That was a lot of work. There, that that's quite quite fiddly to do. That was. And I glued all the pieces on. There's nothing to glue on there. But that's that's glued on. Like I said, the clear parts I put in. I'll just I should just mask them up. When I, uh, when the time comes. All these, I've done all the sides, they're all glued on. All these are adjustable, as you can see. You just got to just take your time, be careful with your gluing, and you'll have no trouble at all, as you can see. And the back, the back's all done, they're all glued on, it's all ready to go. Same on this side. Yeah, that's all done there. Again, they're all adjustable. There's nothing, nothing really underneath to see. The de really good detail though. The inside, I, I think the inside is oh, actually it's obviously that, that's so well detailed. But there's nothing. I've done nothing extra since my last update on the inside. It's just how I, how I left it. All I've done is just glued it together. Well, I've got a bit more weathering to do on there. Get yeah, a few pigments and that. Uh, right, this is the, the top of it. Again, that's that's adjustable. Just take it on, you can move it. it. Does open up? Oops, I've just dropped the piece off. Well, it does adjust. That's the inside. It's all painted. I've just got to paint that piece there. So that'll be. That's ready to go. Once I've finished the inside, I will glue it all together. <clears throat> I made a start on one of the back panels on the back. That's the, that's the outside. But I'm not going to fit... There's two pieces of fat to fit on there. But I'm not going to fit that yet. I want to I want to spray it all first. Then I'm going to spray it black. Spray the inside black. Just so it's like a shadow. So, um. You can't, you won't be able to see him because it actually fits there on that bit there. So I don't want to be able to see him and see nothing. So if I put it like a black coat on there, you shouldn't, you shouldn't see the inside. There's also this bit as well. That's actually finished. These doors, uh, you can have these open. You can pose them open. All I'll do. You just glue them in position when the time comes. But they are, they're just dry fitted at the moment. But that's all ready. I've had to glue these hinges on. Yeah. They've got to be glued on. But everything else is already on. I know there's injector pin marks there, but you're not going to see them once it's all glued together. This piece here is not quite finished yet. That's part of the back. I've just got to finish that off. 
some little bits of photo etch to glue on here but I'm, I'm going to do them once I've got it all glued together just in case I knock any pieces off then I'm ready to start on the wheels all the wheels are done as you can see the two sprockets beautifully detailed no problem at all the only trouble I had was the um, what's the names the, the sprue tabs are in the in between the safe there which made it you know it wasn't difficult but it just made it a bit more a bit trickier to clean up so that's them these are the I've got the two two idlers yeah they they're nice they went together nice and then you've got the road wheels. I've just brought two out just to show you. Uh, these are these are really detailed. I've just got to clean them up. As you can see, I mean the the pattern on it's beautiful. So detailed. Well, yeah, can't fault it. Lots lots of wheels. Now the tracks. I've never seen never seen this style of mini art before. But the tracks are actually. Um, they're pinned together you don't need to glue them and they are, they are solid they're really good and they're workable all I've done is put the pins in and I'll just put little dabs of super glue on the ends just to stop the pins coming out but there's no need to they are they are in there really good but I just wanted to make sure they didn't come out but as you can see they're fully workable so there's no need to glue, put any glue at all here. They're so, they're so easy to do, the easiest tracks I've done for quite a long time. But just make, there's not like I say, just fit, even even just pushing them together, they hold in position. Cut your pins off, put your pin in, cut it off, and then that's it, job done. But like I said, I've just just put little dabs of super glue on the ends just to make sure well, as I said look they are workable and you should be able to knock the knock these out in a night no problem at all I just wanted to just try and so I could show you on the update what how easy they what they look like and they're gonna be no problem at all so that's it there's nothing else to show you I've, everything else you've seen I've done I'm up to date uh, the instructions are clear, no problem at all. Um, but I've, I do, I will say one thing. When I on, when I actually opened the kit up and I, I, I looked at it, I noticed I was one of the frets, photo etch frets missing. Like there's a small, there's three of them in the kit. Yeah, I'll show you so, so you can see what I'm on about. There, that one there was missing. That one there, which is photo etch A. So I got straight on to the email. I emailed Mini Art, um, and sure enough, they answered every email. All I had to do was send some photos of what was missing, a picture of what was missing, and and a picture of the kit, just so they could see. And uh, within two weeks, they sent it through the post free of charge. So their their customer their customer care, I can't fault it. So fair play to Mini Art for that. Uh, it was great. I couldn't fault it. Um, but yeah. So basically, I'm, I've got. They sent it through the post. Free, like I say, free of charge. So thank you for looking. Um, I hope you all have a nice Christmas and a, and a great New Year. And stay safe. And I'll see you for the next update. Thanks for looking. Thank you.